y'all, it's Desiree from I Can You Can Vegan. No, before you ask, these are not meat tacos. You are looking at my new favorite, sweet and spicy Jamaican jerk jackfruit tacos, y'all. So here's how to make them. The first step is to take your canned jackfruit that was either in water or brine and separate the seeds from the stringy parts. So this part is completely optional, but I think it helps to make the jackfruit look way more meat-like. So if you're trying to trick somebody, keep this in mind you'll end up with these two piles here and you're going to take the stringy parts and add them to the center of a clean dish towel and then just squeeze all that excess water out so this is the same concept that you would kind of use for tofu you want to press all the water out so that it's able to absorb the flavors that you're going to add to it so when you're finished squeezing it it's going to look kind of like this and you'll just lightly separate this, your new jackfruit, and add it to a bowl. Once all of the jackfruit is in a bowl, you want to add in your seasoning. So in this case, the seasoning that we're gonna use is going to be my favorite, Walker's Wood Jamaican Jerk Marinade. So if you're like me, you can add quite a bit, but if you can't hang with the spicy gang, don't, don't be adding a whole lot of jerk seasoning, y'all. It's hot, trust me. So once it's all stirred together, you wanna add all of your jackfruit to a pan that's lined with parchment paper just so that it doesn't stick to the pan underneath. Um, so once it's all added, you wanna just lightly separate it a little bit like I'm doing in this slide here just so that it has a little breathing room. Pop that in the oven and go ahead and start working on your plantain. So this is how I like to prepare my plantains. I just take a really sharp knife and cut each piece diagonally because I think they fry more evenly that way. And then just take each one and remove the outer peel from them and then just set each one to the side until I'm ready to fry them. Now I realize that there are a lot of different ways to fry plantains, so if you already have a way that's working for you, go ahead and do it that way. There's no one right way to do this. All right, so once your jackfruit is finished, this is what it's gonna look like. As you can see, the texture is exactly how we want it. See those little crispy bits on the edges? That is why we bake the jackfruit. All right, so we're gonna set this to the side until we need it. Now it's time to go ahead and fry up those plantains. We're just gonna add them to some very, very hot oil. You're gonna fry them on both sides until they're very golden brown. It's a really, really easy, simple process, y'all. I mean, all I did was literally just slice and fry, slice and fry, and flip, of course. You definitely wanna flip. You can't just do them on one side, like. That's not cool. So once those are done, the only thing that's left to do is go ahead and form your tacos. I snuck off to the side and sauteed some bell peppers and onions together to add to these tacos. So that's what you're seeing here. And then I'm just using a little bit of fresh cilantro to garnish. So at this point, you're ready to tear these things down, y'all. They are so good. The sweetness from the plantains, the spiciness from the jackfruit, like it is everything. This is the perfect combination, y'all. So if you're new to jackfruit, this is definitely a good way to get introduced it's very easy to cook and of course you can get the full recipe over at my blog at icanyoucanvegan.com okay so be honest with me y'all are you gonna try jackfruit let me know in the comments below and be sure to share this recipe with a friend see you next time